reason to return. My name is Malcolm Ruff, the Creative Director of Logical Drama. Stay with me. Thank you. We can use any of the method to achieve both dresses or any other style that comes to you. All we need to do is to just adjust a little bit. So today I'll be looking at uh, these following dresses using my dress block. I have my dress block already traced on the paper. All I need to do is to adjust it at the hem. I'm going to shape it. I'm going to make it into pencil, into pencil dress. So I'll be taking it about one inch and I'll take it out to my to my hip level. So the next thing I'm going to do is shaping up the shoulder leg. So it's very simple. All I need to do is just uh, make a straight line from the shoulder tip downwards. And I'm going to measure inwardly to it about one centimeter. About one centimeter. One centimeter by by 21 centimeter. By 21 centimeter. That's for the slits. Sorry, that's for the that's for the ham. It's coming to six. Now, before we go further, let me quickly show us one or two things. I am using my, my dress uh, block. Like I said, I have both the back and front together. So this is the neckline for the back, and this is the neckline for the front. So I have center front and center back together. How because I'm going to use it for both the center back and the center front of the dress. So stay with me. So the next thing I'm going to do is, like I said, this will serve as where the uh, the wrist will pass through. Then I'm going to connect it. It depends on you how deep you want this uh, fullness to look. So I'm going to measure up. Inches, depends on how you want it. Then I'll connect it to where my hand is or where my wrist will be. So at the end of the day, with this sorry, with this kind of shape, you're going to have more or less like a cow cow shape and all of that. But if you want more fullness, you need to slash. That is, you can use the slash and spread later. But for now, you can have it this way, and it will be more full. And if you want it fuller, like I said. It means you'll be introducing slash and spread method. We're going to look at that again. So for the second uh, for the second dress, how we'll be creating a shape here, a shape just the way it looks in this direction. I'll be using this screw, this curve to, to create my shape in this direction. Bring it down a little bit more. Yeah. 
shape in this direction. Shape in this direction. At the end of the day, I'll be cutting this out. You can see I'll be cutting this out because it is a white neck. So for me to really achieve the pants now. How this is done, let me just show us how to trace it out. So, like I said, this will serve as the plan for the center front and the center back. So, this is traced out, it's on fold. So, by the time you're cutting, you're going to be cutting with the foot. You have a seam allowance, or you had a seam allowance around it in this direction. In this direction, that is if you are using the fabric, or if you're using like an elastic amount, you don't need all this. This will just be a gap for you to know what. To measure. So um, let me show you something. So for recap, I will just quickly explain. Hello everyone. So I want to show you how to, how to slash and spread and uh, cut your nose to stay loose. Illustration on the table, you can see I've already slashed. And uh, if I'm to place it on another uh, paper, it means that I'll be incorporating some inches or centimeter as I want. This is to remain in like neckline. This is to remain in neckline. This is a center foot. So 
So this is um, half scale of the cow dress. That particular dress is called cow, but we have different formats, different way of um, achieving it. So for, for us to achieve this particular one, this is how we're going to go about it. All you need to do is to place uh, paper on the it and let me just do that so you can really understand this video. So from the pinning down, you will realize that I've added particular inches or centimeter in between slash paper. So, so now all we need to do is to all we need to do is to connect together, we connect for more fullness, we connect in that direction.